the great idea, uh, and also at Jeff's request, that we do something other than talk about Warhammer stuff. <laughs> uh, here's Battletech. Here's the starter kit. Uh, this is a lot of stuff. There is, seems to be no appreciable difference between any of this, so we're going to take this and this. And then that's yours. Yep. So you go over here, and this is mine. And we're going to muddle through this. <laughs> so. I'll do this way. Yeah. All right. So in lieu, because they don't actually have a mission mode or anything in this. Like, so it's just go and beat the stuffing out of the other dudes. So stuffing we shall beat. <laughs> so 2v2. Yep, this is 2v2. Um, yeah, this is my Wolverine. The, my Griffin, your Wolverine. It's called the Dolphin there. All right. Yeah, so. I was just. <laughs> why, why is the guy blue if the guy on the sheet's red? Because uh, the other guy, there's a different sheet of this that's actually blue. It's around here somewhere. Hmm. Uh, and basically, they look like this because I painted them up to look like this. <laughs> oh, see, here's the blue one. Okay. Yeah. So, here's how this is going to work out. Jeff and I are actually going to be playing these guys, and then I'm going to kind of AI pilot those two. Um, and, we're, and we're not going to get fancy or anything. We're just kind of going to roll for it. <laughs> so, what's that other booklet? This other booklet? Golden Rule by William H. Keith. <laughs> it's a novel. <laughs> or like, a short story. Oh. Huh. So who the dreck is George Suertis? Durant Carlyle wanted to know. I know he's a local fat cat. You're hopeless. Man, that is that is one first sentence with a lot of sci-fi spelling. <laughs> it's a lot of yeah. It's it's a lot. <laughs> All right. So I've only got one one d6 with me today. But that's that should be all we need. So, in case you were wondering, this is a work of fiction. <laughs> Any and all regular, real battle mechs are completely coincidental. Sorry, <laughs> put the book down. Union, cl <laughs> Union class dropship rag muffin. All right. <laughs> Hi there. <laughs> So, Battletech is a game that started in the 1980s, um, and has gone through several iterations since. Uh, I think the most popular games to come out of it were um, the two Mech Warrior game, uh, Mech Warrior 2, and Mech Warrior 3. Uh, I've actually played Mech Warrior 2. Oh yeah, yeah. So this is that universe. For That's what I thought. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and then it's recently had a big revitalization with the Battletech uh, video game that came out for PC. Uh, MechWarrior Online has always kind of been a thing uh, since online gaming came to the fore. But um, aside from MechWarrior Dark Age, uh, Tabletop has not been friendly. So we're going to see if that's changed. <laughs> well, you kind of just... Said it, but we're gonna put it to the test. We're gonna put it to the test. <laughs> so the immediate problem I have is that there's no like player versus AI mode, um, which is just a personal like bugbear, I think. <laughs> um, but yeah, so basically how this is gonna roll out is that uh, I am currently behind the sticks of this Griffin here, and Jeff is piloting this Wolverine here. The red guy. The red guy. Yeah, and we're fighting against a Locust and a Thunderbolt. Um, and this guy looks like a Metal Gear. Metal Gear. From five or four, one of those? With, uh, four. With Old Snake or whatever? Yeah, it was four. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> um, so we've already rolled for initiative, and by rolled for initiative, I have decided that we were going first. <laughs> um, so the side that loses the initiative moves their mech first. So they have to move before us. Uh, oh, not a very good strategy, Cotton. <laughs> well, that's, that's actually where the strategy comes in. So you have to kind of like, you know. 
<laughs> Strategize. <laughs> Alright, so movement modes. You can walk, you can run, you can jump. Um, Thunderbolt has a movement of... Okay, so it moves four spaces or runs to six. And... Suffers a plus two target long effect. Okay. My walking and jumping is five. Yeah. My running is eight. Two, three, four. So he's just going to get there. Um, how about... Um, yeah. I take the other guy. What, the, the locust? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Here. Uh, so you have... Yes, eight walking. Yep, or 12 running. It makes it harder to shoot if you run, yeah. by the way. I'm just going to move them up eight. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> He's getting closer, guys. Okay. So actually, if you would move him back two, because it costs plus one, it, the difficult terrain, in, like in... Um, like in Dungeons and Dragons. Oh. For going over light terrain here. And this is heavy, so it costs two. Okay. So. Um, so, here's the... That's the movement phase. Uh, for them, so I guess we move up now. <laughs> He's actually walking backwards at us the entire time. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Moonwalking Max, got it. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, so uh, you move your five. Make sure if you want, you don't have to go all five. One, by the way, two, three, four, five. It's worth noting that close combat is not really a big issue here. Uh, let me see what you've got. But you've got. Yeah, you've got laser, you've got uh, knife fighting weapons basically. <laughs> knife fight. Mm -hmm. uh, whereas I am going to go. Let's see. I have five. One, two, three, four. Should be able to get in the side arc of that guy. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what the range is. Uh. Okay. Cool. I think I've got this. So shooting. Do you shoot straight? Yes. Just miss him. No. <laughs> well, let's find out. Maybe. Oh, no, it's front arc. Oh, okay. So, yeah, you have an arc. So you could put shots into his side from there, I think. Interesting. So. All right. So, the side that lost initiative declares any attacks the mech will make. Specifying which weapons will be fired at what targets. And then uh, it goes back to us. So my the so Thunderbolt here is going to fire. Okay, it looks like you can just call out everything you want to shoot then. So I'm just going to try and send myself into a... <laughs> I'm going to just shoot the stuffing out of myself, apparently. So one... Two, three, four, five. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah. So large lasers in short range. Machine guns are out of range. Missiles are in. Okay. So first of all, so he moved to. I'm firing at short range. Hey, Jeff, you remember how you were laughing at me about the uh, charts <laughs> that we had in Warhammer trying to figure out how to shoot people? Um, hmm, yes. Yes. Okay, so... So he's got a plus one. Target moved five hexes. That was, or target moved four hexes. That was me. There's plus three. Okay, so he's got a plus three already. Carlisle turned his you auto cannon on the White Worth. <laughs> okay. Whitworth. An old and uncommon battle mech he privately lumped in with the general subgroup. He thought of as Drek Max. 
Uh, okay. Oh, I don't want to read this. <laughs> Whitey's were slow and cumbersome. <laughs> <laughs> Am I allowed to say that? Uh, okay, so seven, I think, is what I need to show on the dice. So the five and a three, that's an eight. Yeah. Okay, yeah, no, I did get that. I got that right on the first try, hot dog. Um, yeah, so I'm going to, we're going to rewind that a little bit. So I'm going to be attacking at short range with the missile launcher. So I need to show a seven to hit me. I got an eight total. Uh, determining hit location. One missile, one point of damage per missile. LRM 15. Carlisle put his shadow on him. <laughs> <laughs> Taking uh, several long bounding strides before kicking in his jump jets and launching his mech into low, flat trajectory. Tra 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 <laughs> Catalyst Games, I'm super happy that you put out a battle mech game, or a battle tech game again, in the year of our Lord 2020. But why is it so friggin' complex? I just want to shoot a dude with a missile. Give me a straight up or down roll. Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh my freaking crap! Oh man, am I am I wounded? Am I am I broken by Warhammer? Is that it? Like just a freaking number, dude! Just give me a shoot. No, <laughs> movement to the right caught Carlisle's attention, and he pivoted, bringing his auto cannon to bear. This game is more interesting to read than it is to play. A dragon. I'm going to drag you. Major! <laughs> you shouted, wondering if Kobe could hear him above the thunder. Confirmed! It's a Karita op. How do you know? The dragon opened up with an Imperator A autocannon, sending a stream of high explosive shells slamming into Carlisle's left arm and side. Dragon! <laughs> Alright, so we're going we're gonna to save ourselves some problems here. This requires 2d6 to roll, but you know what? I'm going to use a d12. It says 2d6. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, weapon size 15. <laughs> Why is this? Hit location table. Okay. Page 12. Hit location. 2d6. So, missile hits me on 1, which is a center torso. Center mass. Boom. Pow. Okay. Um. Uh, Hit location rule, okay. Oh, okay, so since this is an LRM 15. Seven, okay. More center torso, okay, so two shots to the center torso. Okay, so. Uh, so that messes up me armor on my torso, of which I have. Looks like 1, 2, 3, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 20. Okay. That's one, so that's 3 damage total. So I'm down 3 damage on my center torso. Okay. <laughs> Let's try something slightly easier. How about that? Uh, 3 medium lasers. So uh, we're still at, what, 7 to hit? Yeah, no, actually, this is on a 9 plus eight. Is this guy still attacking you? Yeah, he's got a laundry list of guns, and you've oh, got geez. a laundry list of guns, too. Uh, so it's like a 9 to hit. But, like, does he fire all at the same time? Or? Yeah. Oh. At least that's the that's the that's what I could get from it. Like, you just unload everything after you say where your shots are going. And since I'm trying to play a dumb AI here, <laughs> like, everything's just going at me. So, yeah, uh, that hits. Oh, there are three of these, son of a gun. Okay, so one, one hits on the right torso, another on the right torso, and another at the center mass, left leg. Uh, and that's five damage total. 250 million C bills, DeSalva said. 
his voice a near whisper as he did the math. Colby's eyes widened. So that's the Death Guild's pay. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> okay. Okay, cool. So that knocks some, some more armor off my leg and my right torso. Okay. So in the interest of you getting to do something, he's going to not fire any more of his weapons because they're mostly useless anyway. I just want to just say something here. Mm -hmm. If you're doing like a... Uh, like a grounded kind of gritty novel. Yeah. Maybe don't use the word yuppers. <laughs> I don't know, man. It's it's the year 3000 in the Battletech universe. I think yuppers survives. All right. All right. So here's how this works. Let's see if I can <laughs> communicate this effectively to you. Okay. So here's your attack modifiers. Your gunnery skill. That's four. Four. Yeah. So that's what you'd have to roll. So you moved, you walked, so that's a five. Mm -hmm. uh, your target, that's you, uh, moved, yeah, four hexes plus one. Uh, it's in the clear otherwise, and it looks like everything you've got is at medium range, or no, at short range. Medium laser is a short range. One, two, three. No, everything's a, everything's at medium range for you. So you're at uh, eights to hit. Small lasers. I can do small lasers. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I think. Yes, but they're at. Um, that, if that is. A oh short... no! Actually, they're out of range because they're three hexes. It's more than three hexes away. So you just get your two. So wait, shot. what's this? Is this shot? Oh, short. Shot. Short range, medium range, long range. Right. So. Three, uh, everything you can fire is at medium range right now because it's within three to six hexes. Oh, gotcha. Get it? Yep. All, All right. right. So you're at eights to hit. Here's your D12. Roll it once for each medium laser. All right. First one is Five. a miss. Second one Woo. hits. Wait, no. <laughs> not, not woo. I was just excited I got higher than okay. an eight. Uh, okay, roll it again to see where you get hit. Two. Center torso. That's good. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Uh, that's good because you have the most armor there. So that just knocks off uh, armor. Is it knocks out one armor or the amount of armor is damaged? I don't, I don't know, but I don't get these numbers that are next to the things on the thing. Because this only um, has like 9 hits on the head, but it says 12 head on here. Right, but that's what you have to roll to hit it in the head. Ah. And that and that's that goes the same for all mechs. Oh, I see. Yes. Yeah, so that's just a quick reference. Sorry. Phone buzzed at me. Uh, anyway. So, you're done shooting with him. So, uh, return fire. So, let's talk about what you've got on here. Ta da Okay. Uh, you've got a medium laser located in your head for some reason. Uh, another medium laser in your right arm. A large laser, which does more damage and is longer ranged. And a uh, short range missile launcher. Um, so you've got one of each of these. So let's do the two medium lasers um, because those are at medium range right now. So you moved. So mm -hmm. that's plus, so your gunnery skill is four, plus one is five for moving. Uh, your dude moved five to six hexes, so that's another plus two. Uh, and you're at medium range with your uh, regular lasers, so you need to show nines to hit it. Nine plus. W T F. What the dreck? See, I know battle tech terms. No, you don't roll those dice. <laughs> okay, there's one miss, and the other one. On the table, please. You're not the boss of me. Twelve. That's a hit. <laughs> okay, so where do you hit the dude? Good question. Two. Center torso. So your medium laser inflicts five points of damage on its me on its torso. So that's halfway done. Yeah. Boom, baby. And now you've got your large laser to fire, which is going to be at a seven to hit no uh, 
And your short range missiles, which are nines. Yeah. Yay! Yay! Uh, center torso, or yeah, determine hit location. Five. Uh, it's a right leg. So cool. that does uh, 6, 12, 18, no, 2, 4, 6 damage to his leg. So it's sheared off a bunch of armor there. Yep. Cool. He has two more hits to his leg and like yeah. five more hits to his torso. Yeah. Yay. Bam! Yay for us. We think we're doing this right, folks, but good lord. <laughs> <laughs> we're trying. <laughs> All right, so I've got a LRM-10 and a PPC. I'm going to shoot him. Uh, I'm just going to shoot shoot him with the PPC, and I'm going to shoot him with the LRM. So first we're going to do the PPC, the particle projector cannon, by the way. Um, I moved, he moved. My gunnery skill is four, so I'm already at six. Uh, I'm at medium range from him, so it's eight to hit. Yeah, there's it. Oh, yeah. Uh, cluster hit table for one. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, three hits. So, one at the five is the right leg. So, his right leg's armor is destroyed. Four is right arm. Uh, so, that takes out his arm armor. And seven is the center torso, uh, which has just taken, yeah, another couple of damage. Uh, I think it's out of armor in there. Okay. So let's check what happens when you run out of armor. In places. In places. Torso and his right side, pretty much. Almost. Yeah. Uh, Okay, so damage goes to the next location inward, right or left. Torso has all of its arm armor blown off. Okay, so not the torso, but the yeah. So I wrecked its leg and I wrecked its right torso, but I haven't blown him off yet. No, no, no. You you wrecked his right arm, right leg, and center torso. Oh, center torso. Okay. Uh, how much damage does he have? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I, I think I actually did blow off his leg. Uh, has all, okay, if a leg destruction... Destroying a mech. Okay, that's not dead. It ain't dead yet, but he's basically got, like, one hit left in him. I'm going to shoot the uh, LRM at the other dude. But he can't move now, so... Yeah, no, his leg is yeah. knackered. <laughs> Basically, he's fallen over and he can't get up. <laughs> so, one shot with the PPC goes blam, blam. Definitely hits. Oh, wait. Oh. How many How many hits did, the, did you get on the torso? Ten. Oh, yeah. No, so, he's just dead. Never mind. Yeah, he's, he's, just, he's just dead. Yeah. Pew! Okay. <laughs> anyway, PPC to center torso does 10 damage to the big boy, so that knocks out that much damage on him. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> and now we roll for initiative. So, uh, bad guys, get a four. And here, you roll for us. One! Okay, well, whoever loses initiative moves and shoots first. So, uh, you have your movement. So, yeah, you go ahead and move, and I'll think tactically i guess um you have no idea if we're doing this right but kind of fun now two three four five now face this way yeah yeah one two three four five shoot him <laughs> shoot um, up. yeah so basically we're just gonna lay all our weapons into this dude uh, but he's going to move next. Uh, and he has a walking speed of four. So he's a one, two, four. Uh, coward. Because <laughs> also because a lot of his weapons are fine at long range and we're kind of more knife fighty. Mm -hmm. So we get to shoot first, though. So 
Uh, go ahead. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. So everything is going to be at long range for you, with the exception of the large laser. Hmm. So you moved, he moved, long range. I think you're looking at eights for the long, eight for the long laser, and twelve on the uh, oh. other stuff. All right. So do large laser yeah. first. So for an eight, not getting it. Boo! All right. Let's see if you can get twelves. <laughs> Mini laser. Nope. SRM. Nope. And medium laser. No. Okay. Well, that's how it goes. I had a one in twelve chance of getting it. Yeah. <laughs> and I failed. Mm -hmm. And you failed. <laughs> uh, all right. I've got. I'm at one, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm in short range for everything. Uh, he moved, I moved. My gunnery skill is four, so anything uh, six or above. So PPC first. There's a hit. And seven is the center torso. That's another ten damage there. So three, six, eight. 6, 12, 18. So he's got two two damage left on his center torso. Okay. That uh, hit him with a missile. Where does it hit? Uh, 10? I think I just left shot, arm. Him, shot him in the butt. Yeah. <laughs> left arm. So um, one per missile. Cluster hits. Size 4? Four. four. Okay, so that's four shots. This, okay. Chris wasn't kidding when we were talking about this before we shot. <laughs> LRMs can get stuffed. Um, <laughs> so I think that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eight, Left arm. Left arm, yeah, right. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So his torso is crippled, his left arm is beat up but he is not dead yet so thunderbolt shoots back was, uh... i was looking at the wrong mech dragon <laughs> 6 12 18 so he's got three six six uh, he's got nine damage left on his torso and he's got two three four five six so he's oh got... you were looking at the wrong I was one i was looking at the wrong one yeah his his left arm is still beat up and his center torso is still nine shot like nine damage away from crippled but um yeah now he's going to uh split fire back uh, he can't shoot us with the machine guns uh he has one large laser which he's gonna long bomb at you uh he's got three medium lasers which he's gonna long bomb at me uh and then he's we're just gonna pretend like the missile launchers in this game don't exist for a minute <laughs> uh so first going at you large laser uh, you are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight shot, eight, eight, whatever's away. Spaces. Spaces, yeah. Uh, you moved, he moved, four plus two. So he needs eight to hit you. And he hits you. Uh, where does he hit you? Ten. Left arm. Left arm. Uh, okay. So that's eight damage to your left arm. Okay. Yeah, you're still kicking. It's fine. Uh, medium lasers. You're like 10 left on my left yeah. arm. Yeah. yeah. So he's going to shoot. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So he's going to shoot at me. Uh, needs eights again. One hit. Two hits. Two hits. Uh, first one goes to my six, which is my right torso, and the other one goes to my head. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> uh, I just got shot in the head for five damage, and I just got winged in the right arm for or right torso for five damage also. Or yeah, five damage. So five and five. Ow! <laughs> Yikes. Uh, okay, well, time for initiative then. Uh, here, you roll for us. Are you sure you want this? Yes. Ten. Ten. And he rolls eight, so he moves first. Death or glory. <laughs> um, how do you want to move? 
Um, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I'll move one. Okay. <laughs> so I'm in range of this guy for all my short stuff. Yeah, we're just gonna we're gonna skewer this guy. <laughs> Had about enough of you. Um, so we've got he's got three medium. <laughs> one, two, three. Okay, he's in he's in machine gun range for me. Well, barely, but he may as well use him. Um, oh wait, but I moved one, right? Yeah. One, two. Three. I'm gonna move. Closer. Yeah, okay. closer. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> You're just going to hose him. <laughs> um, okay. So, right. he's going to shoot machine guns at me. He's going to shoot large laser at you. Medium lasers. Two medium lasers at you and one at me. So, here's machine guns at me. Um, let's see. He needs... He moved. I moved. Plus four. Plus another four. Seven doesn't hit. Uh, ten hits. Uh, he shot me in the head for two damage. Son of a gun. Oof. Uh, yeah, so I go from... I got like three three hits remaining up there. Uh, what shoot. happens if your head gets destroyed? Anything? Or? <laughs> well, I think there's a rule in there about this. Um, multiple mechs. Destroying a mech. A mech is destroyed if its head or center torso is destroyed. Destroyed mechs are removed from the map. Okay. And have no further effect on gameplay. <laughs> you know what's in the head most of the time? Cockpits. Cockpits, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's why a death from above attack is usually so lethal, because it just goes right, mm. on the, right in the kisser. Um, large laser is at you. Um, I think that hits. Because you moved, he moved, plus four. Yeah. And okay. you're at short range. Uh, so that goes to your 11. Uh-oh. That's your left arm. Yeah. How many? Um, eight. Ooh. So wait. It was eight before. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight more. Mm -hmm. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Ooh, I only have Ooh. two left on my well, left you're arm. Well, it's still on there. <laughs> uh, there's going to be two medium lasers at you and one at me. Uh, it's now looking Here's good. Here's at me. Nope. Here's at you. Yes. Uh, four. That goes right to the other arm. So that's five damage on the other arm. Yikes. And one more. Ten. I think you just got shot in the shot in the left arm. Yeah, there goes your lefty. <laughs> so that takes arm. out your nothing. You see, you had nothing on the left arm. That's RM six. That's left torso. Oh. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Oh, okay. I see, yeah. Yeah. Yay! <laughs> and nothing of value was lost. <laughs> just like, just like, I can still draw because I'm right-handed. <laughs> yeah, go get get shooting. Alrighty. All right. So let's just forget the SRMs exist because they're a pain in the butt to figure out. Medium laser one. Um, you're at short range. You moved. He moved. Plus four, four. so six is yeah. Woo! There's a hit. Uh. Where do I hit him? Yep. Uh, in the one. nothing. In the torso. What? So this game is designed to be played with 2d6, so I just decided that ones are in the torso. Oh, okay. Uh, so that's... So you took 20 damage to his torso before. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12, I think you might have blown him up, but... Uh, yes. Yeah. Good. <coughs> okay. So, some things need to be um, addressed, I believe. First of all, we don't know really what we're doing, and these quick start <laughs> rules are a little bit uh, janky, but here's the thing. That was kind of fun. It was a little <laughs> bit fun. Once, once we got our heads around it, we, we figured we out... We need to play again. Yeah. We're, we'll probably have to come back to this one. Uh, we'll also have to figure out a way to like mark this better than yeah, just, just guess. Kind of remember <laughs> it. Yeah, and I mean, all, all this is guesswork. We're trying to make this entertaining, so we're not just punching each other in the face with lasers and missiles. Uh, that missile system needs to go away, very far away from me, forever. Um, 
but I think uh, I think that's a pretty pretty decent. Um, I mean, obviously, it would probably help if I had two d six instead of a d twelve. But heck with it, right? Uh, you know what? Sometimes with these games, you have to make up your own fun. Just saying, with what I just rolled. Yeah. You have down five on your torso again. No, <laughs> I think I actually nuked me. <laughs> kaboom! 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 Hey, you know what? If the, even if the miniatures game isn't super great, the miniatures themselves are awesome. So. Well, this is coming from the, the mech guy too. So right, keep that but I mean they're really they're really solid. They're well redesigned mechs from their former iterations in the eighties. This is, I mean, it's a step in the right direction. Is uh, this not the original? No, this oh. is the re-release. Gotcha. This is the recent re-release. So um, we didn't even use the cards. No, the cards are the cards are in there for more stuff, but. I'm going to see if I can drum up a way to make a, like a campaign or something out of this using the rules that we have messed with. Mm. <laughs> and that I think we might actually be able to figure out something fun to be done with this. But that will come later. So, anyway, put the book back. I think we need another dragon inserted right here. Dragon! <laughs> dragon! Thank you. And as always... We'll see you. See you next time with more Battle Tech. Maybe. Robot Jocks! <laughs> Thank you, Strong Mad. <laughs> Robot Jocks! If you like what you just saw, why don't you hit that subscribe button and get updated about everything that we're working on here? And while you're at it, you can check out our 1000 Points or Bust playlist here at the Miniature Rundown on Game Twaddle. Thanks for watching.